Okay, looks like it's for the first official edition of my vlog after the premiere. So, of course, I can get it for this one because that'll be the first time we'll two 11 minutes instead of this one. Because last week they, um, yeah, we aired up the, instead of the episode. You know, we had the two episodes on iTunes, but instead of two episodes, we had one episode, the first one, and a new one. So, this week we had the one that was last week along with the new one. That new one's gone right now. I just, I'm waiting until it came on and big country can't show it because the underground ground and the new one. Come on, let's talk about Rooting for the Enemy, written by Scott Peterson. Yeah, I'm gonna get one by for this really good well. Could have only one or two writers. So about to you know, come show uh, hopefully both show do be all gone, I will get go writers. So I mean go in the episode. Milo go to a first football game because because of course they ban him from football game due to his home birthing law thing. But they invite him over for this game because they previously have given up and think we're gonna lose anyway, so Milo can't make him think any worse. They're, they're just lazy inevitable. But however, they get the brilliant idea to have them root for the other team, go across the front to them, go up they will win by default. Go, there's your plot. Go. So, okay, first of all, I don't know in this one. Um, in can get some production where this pair was kind of high up, that means 12 more in a row. For that, like, well, the quarter. Which, interesting. Um, I, Dan has said, well, one, they're going to be holiday episodes, which will next year, so that's great. And they have written at least three songs for the show, which can, we can probably finish with the first few episodes, either have no song or just a little song, but at a certain point, we have all the episodes of song. So I compose the Regan one for two of them because they didn't know where we were going to do that, and once they wrote the first couple of songs, kind of, okay, let's do it, did the Or it'll be like, independent of getting song next week, I'm not going to make sure I have thing up like missing next week. Okay. So, but we call the first one that is called by Milo, which is the first actual we don't call the show, and it's basically a song about how he grew for the enemy, and it's a very catchy, entertaining song, even better than what from last week, very fun. I forget how quite help. It's another pretty good one, it's it, another one that picks up the plot a little more, and we get to see Milo using him power for good, you know? It do intentionally call the fortune Bummer, but it to you a power intentionally. Usually he just kinda like all oh, well happened here. He intentionally you can power him in some way, which I thought be very, very interesting. Now you get to come from fortune to another team. Yeah, that kinda really be good, but I do feel like mm, you know, I feel like it worked in the kind of because it's different. And like like you yeah, have before the the cap is very funny. There's a, there's a lot more sort of flat day going on in the cup of Okay, a couple people could be bought by a patient because it takes till near the end for the contest him and for me to come up. The first, like, quarter of building up the football game and getting all that up, and then they're them at the football game and them, you know, doing stuff, and then they decide, hey, what happened for me? But I feel like that locked up long enough, especially because of the vehicle montage. You know, and they fit in a lot, a lot of good jokes. Um, you know, um, apparently, I, I wasn't looking at but, um, Conwin said, at one point, Conwin said, this is like football at Kevin. Which is the official confirmation of it being Game Universe. Because before we hit it, I'll get flick it. I wasn't listening, but at least two people in the tweet have yeah, said that, yeah, I'm going to say that. So, there you go. I do think I'm going to want to know. Um, <laughs> yeah, but, uh, well, but, oh well. Um, the, the, I'm not sure about the game about the because it has a more unique plot and it's completely funny. The show is just funny. Like, I do feel like, arguably, it might become funny or funny. Because I think it's funny, but, you know, early on, the comedy can make in the first game, because our episode, like, I don't know, like, boyfriend, for example, being keyboard, the comedy will flow, you can kind of tell them. Okay. But apparently, the episode jam-packed with joke here, the episode jam-packed with joke one after the other. Or if not a joke, it's a funny class. Bit or just their real energy, and the guy who has a lot of energy tend to it, even though it doesn't con maybe go big one. I'll go over a good part where he's talking to Mort, um, and uh, he more fortunate happened to Mort, but we're like, no, not, I'm pretty sure it's not Mort being allowed to just bunch of or something like that. And I, it didn't be no found, no one he to really be mad at my or hate him, kind of, yeah, why do him the VLOG? Um, you know, one, kind of valley, don't get to hate him, like. At one point, my little, you know, she, she hey, wanna get with me, and she's like, nah, I'm still recovering from last time, but like, I'm doing the mile of the other. Oh, okay. Your dinner's ready when it's time, yeah. okay? Yeah, okay. Or, come out or I'll cut you. No, I'm just okay. kidding. Okay, okay. Yeah. 
And if people can be content with that, if you talk to Bradley, everyone can do, they avoid him, but they're still genuinely friendly when they like him, you know, and kind of, which I think is actually are interesting, how he is kind of an outcast, but not in that everyone hates him, like, people just don't want to get hurt, right? I mean, for Depco, like, at the book top, the book you know, she's very friendly, and will go away from him, you know, but rather at the so far, she's been with him from thick and thin, so, I'd plug in that instant, she was just like, yeah. Um, so... But, and I guess, I do wonder, I sure if I'm gonna get the curious thing that I want, I don't track, though, how, in real life, that, how, if I'm like, gonna carry on with other people, he goes, oh, sorry, but most of it, she's like, he, like, he can very reactionary, like, he just kind of react to things, and, uh, and um, yeah, I feel like I should get that well, but, I do, well, we kind of feel surrounded by having more replies with it, but, though, more interesting, I think, like, ignoring other people's pain, which, Interesting. Um, I feel like it, I think stuff like that doesn't matter because it's so funny. No, that matters. You do wonder if that can be addressed. Like they'll have, they'll play it up for more curious, or they'll just have what happens to people. They come more. They guess you come for a thing that happens to people in the cup of code. Although my uncle Cobb started hurting in the cup of code well, worth knowing he, you know, he has an oblivion. Uncle Gad didn't really do anything in the cup of code. See, I think he's vanishing on kicking half of the thing. Where, um, like, he kind of goes to the football game, but it can't be because Milo, you know. You know, Milo didn't want to go. But after Milo tried to go anyway, that vanishes? I, if he were there, I didn't know to come, which is surprising. But I hope he will. I, I think I'll look alright. I feel like one book coming at least. So, yeah, the Capcom is just another very funny one. But I'll go break into a few more questions about the nature of the show and how I react to Milo because. But in this fact, we don't have, you know, we are morality problems with him. I feel like if it helps me, our team win. I feel like not too bad. Not like he can intentionally do anything bad. Things are kind of happen to him. He doesn't control it. He's generally trying to root. I mean, because he is kind of happy for him. He's like, hey, he can go. You know, so. Um. Uh, he's gone full kind of time now. I don't think. I remember one time, but at the full game, I can't remember what he had. It can't come with Kelly, I know. So, let's see. Oh, number of some potassium are gonna come to it. Um, three of them in a row. All my some potassium are gonna come away. I'm foreshadowing. Um, <laughs> so, there you go. If we can go. I think I'm gonna try okay. Yeah, I'm getting worried about the VR community because so far I've had the little decay about each episode. Because even if any of their free pods, well, I feel like I could get enough decay. And and I won't have a ton of decay until I can kind of have the thing where it's not even more complex storyline. So, I'm going to try and kick off more decay for this show. But so far, all decay is still quite fine enough, and the plot is shrinking up. And your plot is shrinking up. I mean, the, the football game, um, Getting gives you kind of for a lot of joke, a lot of plastic in the cup and there's a lot of energy, a lot of comedy, and very, very funny. And you make you forget the morality stuff because Milo is a Johnny Palm person, and no one hates him. I feel like Captain Bradley, and um, more conversation Bradley might be like us. And like the cup code, when he's getting a teen in at the number of Luka, I thought he was genuine, like out of a joke. You don't know, he wants to get Malika, um, go, yeah, he likes him. I wonder if that's gonna go anywhere. Uh, Maybe, probably, no, knowing the end copy and how the work apply will go somewhere. Go, go have a compare on. Crank that up, probably won't even and trigger all things, but they're going to add the most interesting plot and then probably the most unique. I like with Kong better than Crank up, honestly. I like that Kong too, but this one felt more unique to the show, you know? Ah, uh, it's stuck in my head already. Uh, because we clicked on the app last night, Kong already put it up, so I knew it was going to be a Kong. So. But yeah, Vic and I are very entertaining. Because I think Vic will keep... I don't need to have it up. Because Vic is entertaining. But yeah, it will only last long. At a certain point, it will be too much of a I'm like, okay, but if you're coasting off and not giving it something unique, we're going to get bored. If what you try to laugh. So at a certain point, they will make it up and have more unique storyline. Coming up and coming up, have more unique story go. So, and we'll get story. Again, the show is just funny. I don't think it's story at this point the story doesn't matter because it's genuinely funny and fat paid. But at a certain point, yeah, that can only get taken for a while. But if you knew that in that too long they started to 
time to do more double lane fight with Kovac game two you have more story, or just have Kovac mix things up or make fun. You mix things up like leave us on your fan here between the team one that mix things up and then you know, I feel like that's not gonna happen. Yeah, at a certain point it'll I don't know what point Finian started mixing up. It brought to I believe one month birthday when they started and it would start mixing things up a little bit, you know, create bigger storylines. Yeah, because that why that's cool about comedy, but more more about the story. That's kind of thing. So, yeah, go so Rufus Sammy, you're gonna have a very solid and funny episode. Even if I'm up my favorite go far and turn it out, you pick one with the Uncle Pretty College as well. So, go so far, we got a pretty intense phone on our hands. But it's not giving me a whole lot to say in terms of the story and whatever. That's gonna be because we're talking about one limit at a time. So, kaboom. So, next week we start to get into two limits. So, yeah. Um. I believe, yeah, um, no, no, I was going pretty firm to come at Halloween, so, we're not two weeks from the time of two eleven minutes, so, who knows whether we're having something in November or not, <laughs> you know, my mother being still doing well and being entertaining, hopefully they can either keep up their same value or give them some more new things, and the camp is making me think a bit more morality, and I hope they start addressing that or toning it down, but if they don't, I don't think it'll matter as long as it doesn't get too horrific, but still, I think quite the fun episode. So, next week for Mellon Murphy, we have two episodes for Dr. Cone File and The Note. Finally, Dr. Cone, after uh, being hinted at, I even mean, see a pop up of time ape in this episode. I get to see him. Um. Ooh, that one kind of pretty interesting. Hmm, okay, both kind of very enjoyable, so. That should be fun. Um, so yeah, um, well. Okay, go ahead, next matter three. Um, tomorrow, Climate We Log on Dragon Quest. And the Saturday, we have Top Bolt. So, that should be fun. Rigging Tree and LP King Kick. And also, new to point as the guy will do Climate We Log. I will do one on Halloween for the next clip. And I don't know, first of all, we haven't had that many cartoons on Halloween episodes yet on Disney. And I'm doing Vogue in a blog post, so. Not to be, and I. And I don't think Nick having any that yeah, for cartoon. No, like a horror film last half, but no Halloween yet. So, either way, I uh, should be next week. Well, hopefully, Mal Murphy will finally give me something big to talk about other than if funny or interesting. Well, if it was longer than the kind of time that we lost, oh well, see you next week.